Hello Libra, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now. So this tarot card reading is going to be focused on your love life. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure to subscribe and to turn on the notifications bell. Right, so let's begin your reading. Not sure if I mentioned, but if you want a personal reading, you can get it at the tarotempress.com. Okay, so Libra, what I see is that for some of you, you might be dealing with an individual that brings you a great deal of happiness. This could be a fire sign for some of you. It doesn't have to always be one, right? But I'm picking up the energy uh, that there's this passionate sort of connection. The two of you, you know, can make each other very happy. I feel like the two of you may balance each other out in this beautiful manner. It's actually very exciting, right? So I feel like in terms of the energy, everything looks good on paper, but there could be more to the situation. Let's find out. So I see from these cards, right, this is element of someone perhaps missing an opportunity or, you know, one individual feeling as if the other was taking them for granted. But let's see. I feel like someone wanted more love and attention and the other person, uh, you know, may not have been providing it definitely noticing from the cards that you know the two of you had something good going the energies are showing to me that when it comes to communication things needed to change between the two of you because someone was not letting their guard down it feels as if they weren't fully giving their 100 percent could be due to a fear could be due to the fact that, you know, they were holding back or, you know, there was this other sort of energy behind it, right? So I am sensing that sort of uh, dynamic in the situation. So let's look at the next energy. So it feels as if, right, whenever someone or the two of you had an opportunity uh, to do something or be with each other, someone left, right? Or perhaps um, use some sort of situation as an exit, right? And they didn't do this because they wanted to. I feel like there was a conflict and that was... 
an opportunity to get out. And it doesn't feel as if they were doing that just to sort of leave for good because this person still had and has a lot of love for you. So strange, strange behavior. But yeah, that's just what was happening, right? So it feels as if, right, there was this push-pull dynamic between the two of you where someone would leave or perhaps, the, you know, the two of you would go your separate ways and get back together, right? Lots of energies. But I do feel like there was this excitement that used to come and perhaps the two of you used to, you know, start communicating, chatting together and then there was this confusion and silence. It's sort of like a deadly silence, right? You know what this is referring to because I feel like some of you were only processing the things after, you know, the joy of getting back together occurred. So you didn't really have much time to understand the dynamic of the situation, which is quite peculiar. But yeah, that's what happens in some instances. So it felt as if there was something really dodgy going on here because it felt as if someone came in looking all good, wanting to offer love and there was something that was just a little bit sneaky about someone's behavior. It felt as if they were making a good impression and trying to convince you or someone was trying to convince the other person and this little cycle continued right feels as if one individual became critical crazy and then someone would leave what a strange situation okay so let's look at what are the messages from the spirit guides There is pain here. There is heartbreak. Right. So the cards are pretty clear in terms of the situation. Right. It's time to start celebrating life. For some of you, I feel like you can't look at the situation expecting it to change unless things are done differently and I'm also picking up the energy of you becoming very certain in who you are as a person. I feel like you have to go into your spirituality, start going out and socializing, especially if things have ended. I know that it's going to feel like, you know, you're going to feel a sense of emptiness as a result of the breakup, but there is going to be a light at the end of this tunnel. This is not the be-all and end-all of the situation, right? You will find your happiness some way or the other. 
It doesn't necessarily have to be tied to this individual, but once you start taking back your power and stop being such a victim in the situation, you're going to see this individual is going to be naturally drawn back to you if it, that is what you want, right? The next energy I see is that if you're confused about something, you need to do something about that confusion instead of just saying you don't know what to do. Sometimes Libras can be very indecisive and lacking balance, especially when it comes to their emotions, if they are not understanding something. You know, Libra individuals are very analytical in nature, deep thinkers, but they need to feel like stable, secure. They need that balance. And... I feel like that was taken away from you for some time. So the cards are indicating, yeah, that things will change once you start having love and respect for yourself, right? And I see this individual trying to run away from feeling trapped, stuck in that grief. I do see that eventually they'll potentially reach out to you, especially with these two cards present, which are signifying, you know, uh, things starting up again, but they're going to have to think about it for some time. It's not going to happen overnight. And the more you are drowning in the situation, the worse it's going to feel. And the more hard it is going to be to, you know, resolve these difficulties. I hope you guys enjoyed your reading. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.